U.S. stocks fell again early this morning after oil prices fell below zero. The price drop was caused by a huge decline in gasoline consumption in recent weeks caused by stay-at-home orders from the government during this quarantine. This lack of consumption combined with the constant production has led to an excess of both crude oil and gasoline with a lack of adequate space to store them, leading to the negative prices seen on Monday. The average price per gallon on Monday was around $1.81, over 80 cents less than the price of gas a month ago. Negative prices have been caused by unusual dynamics in the crude oil market, including concerns over storage of the oil. The U.S. is monitoring the North Korea leader, King jong Un, who had a procedure and is in grave danger. Officials started noticing King jong Un misses family events, dinner parties, and gatherings because of his health condition. The U.S. is monitoring his health. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America. And to the republic for which it stands. One nation under God. Indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Partly cloudy with a high of 46 and a low of 28. There will be spotty showers throughout the day. Tomorrow will be cooler with more wind and rain with a high of 40 and a low of 28. Thursday will get back up in the 50s with a low of 35 and some rain showers throughout the day. Friday will have a high of 53 and a low of 32. Saturday will have a high of 57 and a low of 42. It should be pretty sunny with some cloud coverage occasionally. There will be more rain on Sunday and Monday. I'm Amber with your weather. After more than a week of completely shutting down, some golf courses in New York State have reopened with modified rules. While you're on the course, you have to maintain social distancing, and even though they are open, you still can't go into clubhouses to eat or hang out. The only workers that are allowed are the maintenance and the managers. I'm Isabella, your sports.